Hi, I'm Andy for Dram Lawn and Garden. I'm going to explain how to adjust the spray area of your Dram oscillating sprinkler. First, let's take a look at the different parts of the oscillating sprinkler. They are the sprinkler base, motor housing, spray pattern adjustment tabs, fine tuning knob, spray arm, brass spray nozzles, spray arm compression collar, spray arm plug cleanout pin. Before you start using your oscillating sprinkler, please check the following. Check to see that the spray arm is aligned with the black arrow on the motor housing. Check to see that the spray arm compression collar is tight. Check to see that the spray arm plug cleanout pin is secured and in place. Attach your DRAM oscillating sprinkler to any standard garden hose. Set the spray pattern adjustment tabs to the desired position and adjust the spray arm as needed. With the tabs spread as far apart as they can be, your sprinkler will cover its maximum area. With one of the tabs positioned in the center, straight up, your sprinkler will cover only half of its maximum coverage area. You can adjust these tabs for precise, even watering. To affect the spray area, you can always allow more or less water to pass through to the sprinkler by adjusting the water flow at its source. Usually this is the spigot on your house or a water control valve like a DRAM shutoff valve that is in line with your garden hose. The small black knob on the sprinkler base is the control to fine tune the flow of water. It does not completely turn on or off the water, it makes a small adjustment to the water flow to fine tune your coverage area. Personally, I usually just keep the fine tuning knob wide open. Test your sprinkler to see if it's covering the area you desire. Adjust the tabs and water flow as necessary. Thanks for watching. If you're still experiencing troubles after following this guide, please contact DRAM Customer Support. Happy sprinkling!